hey guys welcome back as you saw in the last video we installed tattoo tactile panel in this video we will install wings for our panel and deploy a minecraft server so go to the script and copy it so uh, if you haven't saw the last video where we set up panel i recommend you watching it once now i will go to my command prompt where i accessed my server so now paste the command now uh, in this video we will install wings so choose one so it's asking us if you want to configure your firewall automatically so for those who don't know what it is i will choose it as yes i will recommend you choosing it as yes so now it's asking if you want to automatically configure a user for database host so i will do it as yes so if uh, you uh, if you want my sql to be accessed uh, externally so what it does that uh, you can open mysql in your browser so if you want you can do it but i will do it as no so now database hostname give it as default so press enter now for password i will use it uh, i will use a random password okay so here it's asking us if uh, i want to use https https using let's encrypt i will choose yes now for fqdn we have to choose a, do a subdomain so copy your ip from here go to your dns records uh, add a, a record now for this i will use node 1 and i will paste my ipv address make sure this uh, cloud option for proxy it's disabled we don't want proxy for uh, wing wings so save it now once done uh, copy your domain so node1.mcservergist.bus so it's a dummy domain so type in yes so for email i will use rn at the red rn dot com it's a dummy email you should use your own email now it's asking if i want to proceed with the installation i will type in yes so it's automatically configuring a firewall for us okay so as you can see our wings has been installed and now we will deploy the wings in our uh, pterodactyl panel so go to nodes and create new one but uh, if we just uh, go to a fresh panel and create new one it won't get us so as you can see it's asking us uh, to create a location so it automatically re redirected me to the locations so now i will create a new location with a short code so whatever short code you want so i will just uh, type in us and uh, create a new location so now i will go back to my nodes and create a new node so now you can give it a name so i will give it my node one and description if you want uh, location i have choose as us which i just created so now uh, fqdn do node one dot uh, then your domain just copy it and paste it now give it as default as uh, for ssl we have ssl for our panel and now uh, it's asking us if it's behind proxy as uh, you remember i said you not to uh, tick the proxy option so ours is not behind proxy so we will give it as default also now choose your memory so my server is 32 gb ram so i will do 32 into 1024 so that's my memory and uh, over allocation if you want so just uh, do it as minus one if you want or do it uh, as zero it will disable uh, your uh, 
like by disable uh, creation of more server if it exceeds this limit so i just do minus one for this and for disk space uh, you enter your uh, disk so for this server i have uh, i have so for this server i have 600 gb of disk so I will just put uh, 600 into 1024 whatever it is so again for disk over allocation I will do minus 1 but it's your choice if you want over allocation or no now create uh, your node ok so I made a typo here so it's node 1 now create your node again so now it's uh, created now uh, here in IP address copy your IP and paste it for IP alias do node one node one dot uh, your domain again copy it again now for ports uh, I will choose two five five six five two two five five seven five it will create me ten nodes uh, in this range so. Uh, let's submit this ok as you can see I have created uh, allocation so now uh, let's deploy our wing so go to configuration and generate a token here now copy this and go to your server and paste this ok so now it's uh, done ok so now do system ctl start wings and it should start uh, our wings let's check as you can see we have uh, gotten a green heart which means our wing is uh, running properly now I will go to server and create a minecraft server so click on create new now in server name I will do tutorial and uh, for owner I will choose admin as my owner so it's my default id now allocation I will choose the default allocation now it's asking us for database and everything I will leave it as blank CPU uh, I will choose 400% CPU and for memory I will choose 8 GB for disk let's do uh, for disk let's do 40 GB and now it's asking us for nest so it's already at minecraft I will choose paper minecraft and uh, it's uh, in docker image I will choose java 21 now it will ask me for minecraft version either you can put latest or any minecraft version like 1.21.4 and now you should create the server okay so now the server is creating uh, click on this icon and it will redirect you to your server so as you can see it's uh, saying us that the server is currently running installation process so let the server install ok so it has been installed and it's uh, starting a minecraft server now ok so now accept the yoga pop up and restart your server it will automatically restart ok so as you can see our minecraft server is uh, running so since it was the first startup uh, it took some time but now once it's uh, installed i will copy the address and uh, check if it's online so i will go to mcserverstatus.us and uh, paste my ip and get server status so as you can see it's uh, 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 it's running now I will launch my minecraft and uh, 
join the server okay so my minecraft is launched i will copy my ip and go to minecraft multiplayer then i will choose uh, my server so join server 